Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my nighttime clean with me. I almost called it an after dark clean with me, but now that it's almost summer, that doesn't work anymore because it is still light out. But first thing I'm doing is tackling our playroom, putting everything back where it belongs. Um, and then a little bit later, I'm going to vacuum and mop in here. I did do some stuff in between that because my two-year-old was still trying to fall asleep and he only falls asleep with his door open. Um, he just gets scared if his door is shut. So obviously I wanted to make sure that he was asleep before I started vacuuming and we could shut his door. Um, so yeah, that is why you'll see me go a little bit out of order. Okay, so now I'm going on to the dining area and the kitchen for a little bit. It really wasn't too messy because we did not cook dinner on this night, or I didn't cook dinner, I should say. I'm the only one in the house who does any cooking. Um, but we actually went to the zoo this day. I was exhausted when I was filming this. It was such a long day, it was so much fun. Um, but taking two toddlers to the zoo is definitely an adventure. So yeah, that's why we went out to eat Dairy Queen afterwards. We we could get some ice cream. It was 92, I think, on this day here. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments what is the weather like where you live because we've had a very cold spring um, and now all of a sudden it's May and it's in the 90s, but I'm not complaining because I personally love the heat. Okay, so now that I've wiped everything down, I'm going to light a candle. I love doing this. I feel like the kitchen isn't officially clean until I light a candle, but are you guys in candles still? I feel like they're kind of old school. Everyone's moved on to the oils and the diffusers, which honestly, I've never really been interested in them. I mean, I'm sure they're great. I know people who use them swear by them, um, but I still really like candles. I've also read conflicting things online um, about oils being safe for cats, which I obviously like don't want to risk anything. So yeah, I like my candles, but let me know, do you guys still like candles? Or are you on the oil trend? Okay, so I've been trying out this new mop and I'm honestly not a big fan of it. It's O Cedar, which is my normal mop, is that same brand as well. Um, and I got this just for like more convenient mopping because it doesn't come with a mop bucket. You just squirt the water out of the thing onto the floor and then wipe it down. And it doesn't do that good of a job if I'm just being honest. At least maybe my floors are just extra dirty, which they probably are because I have a one-year-old and a two-year-old and lots of juice spillage and everything else. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna stick with my heavy duty mop unless I'm just doing like a small area. But here I'm working on the half bath. This, <laughs> I forget now that we've been potty trained since February, I'm like still trying to remember that I need to clean the toilet a little more often now that I have a two year old using it because things get a little bit messy. This toilet was really gross. Um, obviously since I'm a girl, I don't ever lift up the toilet seat unless I clean. So yeah, I don't ever see the mess as much. Um, but yeah, if your toilet gets really, really ucky before you get a chance to clean it, you are not alone because every time I clean this thing, it is gross. You make me smile, what is it that you do? My life was great till you added color. Just wanna love you, just wanna hold you, just wanna be with you till we grow. 
Okay, so I'm trying out a new method to attempt to keep my pantry organized. I um, did a video on how I organized my pantry back in like, I think November or maybe December. Um, so check that out if you need some ideas because it's a good video. But keeping it organized is really, really hard, especially because I'm sure you moms can relate. I will go into the pantry, hide, eat a snack, and not want to bring the wrapper out because I don't want my kids to see what I was eating and then I'll just leave it in there and think that I'll get to it later. And then I don't. So what I'm trying to do is every night grab just like a couple of bins out of the pantry and then just organize those because things get put in the wrong bins, things don't get thrown away, expired things. I don't even realize that they're in there. So I grabbed out our bin with the nuts and I grabbed out our bin with the seasoning and I just tidied those up, threw a couple things away. And so I'm gonna try that. I'll let you guys know how it goes. And now we are moving on to tidying up the living room. Burn so bright. I was day and you were night. Like a spark, we work to ignite. Then yeah, ask yourself, is it worth this fight? I love you so much sometimes, baby. I felt like I couldn't breathe. breathe, breathe. When I look in your eyes, I know I'm right. Here where I need to be. This could be the last time we see each other, but I wanted you to know that. Okay, now I'm moving on to tidying up the mudroom. That's the last thing I'm going to do tonight. I'm really hopeful that we won't need coats and jackets for a long time, so I can just keep those upstairs and hopefully this area will stay a lot more neat and organized. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, leave a comment down below, and I will see you guys on Friday.